Hey, what's going on, you guys? Swift here, and uh, as you all know, it's a uh, Black Ops 2 Midnight Launch, and I am exhausted. I've stayed up as long as I could, as long as I can take it. <laughs> I'm pretty tired right now, and um, this this video is not about the gameplay, but the gameplay you are watching is uh, Kill Confirm, and I'm using the Vector, and I want to get into that that gun, that the details about how to use this gun, what kind of setups you want to use for it. Um, I found this gun to be really good. I found some some tweaks that will make it really great. A lot of people doubted this gun, but I managed to figure it out and uh, have a good setup for it. But uh, it's not about that right now. I want to get into uh, my my impressions and my thoughts on this game. And after the launch and playing hours of this game, I'm, I'm really tired and I want to get some sleep. But I want to get this video done and uh, let you guys know what what's my thoughts because I uh, I get on my Twitter, people are asking if I'm excited, and yes, I have been excited. I've been really waiting for this game. I've been anticipating it, and I'm pumped, and I'm glad it's here. And uh, let me get right into this. Black Ops 2, it is actually, to me, I found it to be a really good game. Uh, I've got a few friends that are already bashing on it, saying, you know what, I'm, I'm having some strong dislikes on it. And I'm not seeing too much... To dislike on this game, um, it's it feels like a, a like an old COD kind of old COD. I don't. I'm not too sure. Like some some COD four similarities where it's, there's times where it's gun on gun. Yes, there's some crazy kill streaks and stuff. They're they're pretty insane. As you'll see me, I'm using the the lightning strike and the the stealth chopper, which just completely just goes ham on this game. You guys will see. You guys will see some beasting with that. But it, it, nonetheless, this game it just it runs smooth. It feels smooth. There's times where it is laggy and the hit detection can be way off. But there's also there are times where it's just really good and really smooth. Majority of the time, I've managed to get into good libraries. I haven't had too much of a hard time in the beginning. There was some issues, but as the night went on, it just got better and better. And I'm really liking this game right now. <laughs> I hope it sticks around, and I, I have the same feeling <laughs> like five months later. I still have the same feeling about it that I'm enjoying it. I'm putting up some pretty good numbers. Nothing too beastly. It seems right now, it, with the, the way the game is made, when kill confirm, for your streaks to really go up and achieve your kill streaks, or point streaks we want to call them, is to uh, grab tags. You really got to pay, play objective. Playing objective in this game is very important. You cannot stress it enough. It, it, it's all about objective playing, and uh, you cannot run away from it. If you do, you're going to get screwed over because you're going to try to get a high kill streak, and it's, it's not going to happen because you got to play objective and you want to get closer and closer. It's going to take a lot of kills to get <laughs> like a veto warship, whatever it's called. It, you know, because it takes quite a bit to even get a stealth chopper, but the stealth chopper is pretty beast. I liked it. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm going to step up on my kill streaks and really go for some higher numbers. Right now, like the highest, I think the highest gameplay I've gotten was uh, was like 35 kills on kill confirmed because the game just goes by so quick. Everybody's grabbing tags trying to get those kill streaks, and it's going by so fast. And uh, it doesn't give you enough time to really get those crazy amount of kills. And another thing is you die pretty quick so to get really into this game get those high numbers try not to die um, it's really cannot die because once you die your streaks over you gotta restart again it, it's, it's crucial this game is crucial it's really uh, it's pretty crazy I like it a lot the only thing you gotta worry about is there's a lot of UAV spams because I'm gonna tell you right now your UAV is actually gonna end up being like your best friend that thing will get you assist, 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 and that will just keep increasing your uh, your your point streak and allowing you to achieve your, those higher kill streaks, which is uh, which is amazing. And it, it's really playing like the objective with UAVs. You're really supporting and helping your team. And um, I, I was playing with a group of my friends, and we were just winning lobbies over and over and over. And uh, you know, the UAV was just it was out there. It was really in every single game. It was really necessary, and a lightning strike. A lightning strike is an awesome kill streak. Don't be afraid to use that, you guys. Um, it's that's like it's like the precision airstrike, but except you're more you're more more of the time you're guaranteed a kill, regardless. I, I seem to find there was one time where I didn't get a kill off of it, but that was about it. And um, that's all I gotta really say about this game. I'm having a blast. I'm enjoying it, and I, I hope it you know it continues and continues to. Uh, Keep the excitement for me. I hope it like stays around, like like Modern for Three, where 
I just drastically got tired of the game and um, <laughs> this game. It's it's cool. I real I, my, ne my next video I'm gonna do a, a vector in depth for you guys because um, I want to get this gun out there. I want I got I got a good setup for you guys. For those who are uh, doubting using this gun, I got something for you guys. So stick around. Follow me on Twitter. Make sure to subscribe if you guys want some more in depth on guns because I'm doing a lot of research with guns and class setups and stuff. I got I got something you guys are really gonna enjoy. And uh, and uh, that's all I got for you guys. I'm out. Peace.